Yeah, well. Hi, welcome back. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> More plot. I had to clear my throat. <laughs> well, no, not really plot as much as um, I'm glad you're Monica. Monica. Get up off your knees. We're Come on, I'm not that cool. <laughs> Monica Lewinsky. Monica braces? Lewinsky, get off your knees. I don't know. I don't. I don't, I don't get it. Okay. <laughs> no one. No one else remembers that. Nope. <laughs> Bill Clinton. I yeah 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 freaking. I don't know That's last how name. She's not famous. <laughs> oh, did I show you this yet? <clears throat> so you go to the upgrade menu, and I gotta go buy some upgrades real quick, which I'm going to be buying this one. What is it? Spirit magic increases not just MP. Oh, cool. Yep, based on level, so I can go longer with warps without uh, getting into stasis. And so the more you level up, the better your magic will get. Well, this this basically right here says that blocking and dodging doesn't take up enough mana to worry about it. Nice. And I can also... Hey, it's Dave. Are you saying any real words? <laughs> Look, it's Dave. I love him. And his dog that is a bobblehead that only goes back and forth. All right, well, we're not they just picked up that dog model and just placed him down in a new area. <laughs> I mean, granted, that's what they did with all these characters, but still, it's just it's just funny to me. Dressed in all black like one of them Crowns Guard fellers. I wonder why we're dressed like this. <laughs> hmm. Could it be because we're Crowns Guard? Ooh. Conspiracy. Yeah. Conspiracy. I probably should have taken the car. <laughs> probably so. <laughs> but... Do you need to go grab the car? <laughs> no, I need to get the gun ready. Why? You'll see in a second. You're gonna shoot that homeless guy? No. Heck. <laughs> We're gonna get it. We're gonna go back for that guy on the side of the road. We're gonna go. We have some unfinished business. <laughs> Dino what? gives his regards. <laughs> bah, bah. You know, just a little. Pa, pa. <laughs> Dino sends his wishes. No, no, please. Uh, tell Dino it's got his money. I just gotta gotta get back to town. With that car? I don't think so. <laughs> you could give me a lift. I don't think Dino's feeling that courteous today. Know what I mean? <laughs> Jeez Louise. You do have to reload guns. Oh yeah? Is that Bang. an ice gun? Bang. Yeah, it shoots Blizzard. <laughs> really? Heck yeah. Oh. Overwatch! <laughs> like, Shoot that... Blizzard? <laughs> oh, please do. <laughs> Shut your mouth. Dude. Take WoW off. I will backhand forever. you. <laughs> what does Blizzard do that you like? Overwatch! You oh, I hate Overwatch. Yeah, but freaking, I know, and a lot of people do, but it's cool because there's also a lot of people that love it. I know. Well, there's also diehard Blizzard fans who defend it no matter what they do bad. So. Yeah, I understand that. See, the personally, yeah, true. But uh, Oh, they're worse than Nintendo. Yeah. <laughs> the freaking, the thing about Overwatch At least you is, can defend certain elements of Nintendo. I was talking to a buddy of mine about Overwatch. I bought Overwatch recently, and um, I had already played it like on my channel when the uh, demo was out, like the alpha stuff. But um, I bought it recently because Ashley Ann wanted to play with me because she's been getting into it a lot recently. But we haven't played it yet, so it kind of defeats the purpose of buying it. But anyway. Uh, <laughs> uh, I guess uh, this is a, mes a direct message to Ashley Ann. <laughs> Please play Overwatch with me. I Please want your game. play Overwatch with me. But, um, so we're about to get our first legendary gets, weapon. She just gets busy. Ooh, nice. Tomb of the Wise. Oh, it's my tomb. Uh, but, yeah, wise guy, eh? Yeah, wise guy. <laughs> yeah, just like a curly, just like mummified in the corner. <laughs> oh, core. Whoa. Oh, that was the uh, advisor guy that was with the king, right? He's the bodyguard. Okay. Kind of, kind of messed up. Kind of failed his job if he's still alive and the king's not. But uh, well, he got KO'd pretty early. Oh yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. His name is Core the Invincible. He's not really invincible. He's just tenacious. Would be a better word for him. Yeah. You can't get rid of the guy. <clears throat> king of what? Yeah. King of Loserville. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> High five. All right. Wait. Hold. On. Hey, okay, okay, maybe you can do better. Turkey. Dang it. <laughs> you guys, Whisper can do it. You guys Whisper it. can do it. There you go. <laughs> the only one worth high-fiving around here is me. <laughs> Self-congratulating. This is in-game, by the way. It's not an actual cutscene. Which is crazy. Yeah. Please don't smack my stuff. 
entrusted. <laughs> Why didn't he tell? Me Why would you entrust me with this? <laughs> Calm down, Sasuke. That's a Naruto reference. I thank you. I got that. <laughs> I've never seen it, but even I got that. <laughs> I am dark and emo. Oh, God. He didn't want you to as the king. He wanted you to be his father. Ah, he wait. Wanted to, he, wanted, he wanted you to be his father. Be my daddy. <laughs> <laughs> you're my dad. <laughs> like, you're my dad. But I need a daddy too, you know? That's not how this works. Grandpa, <laughs> Grandpa died years ago. Yeah. Your, your dad's gone. I need my daddy. I'm going to leave now. <laughs> I don't think we need to talk anymore. I think we need to just stop this conversation. Whoa. This is the first legendary weapon you get in the game, by the way. Whoa. Sorry, this is, there's a special name for them, actually. Freaking weird polygon line thing going. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, crap. I forgot. I am now okay. one with your soul. <clears throat> <laughs> the sword just circling around. So now you've just got a new weapon? Yeah, and each time you get another one of these kinds of weapons, you get it starts going around with the other ones you've collected. Nice. The rule of arms are mystical weapons. Blah, blah, blah. Cut off. <laughs> I'm sorry. I That's don't cool. care. <laughs> it's cool. I, I just sorry, not could sorry. not care less. Oh, sorry. It hasn't been added to my inventory yet. This is something I need to patch. There it goes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I probably should have that come in a little sooner. Sword of the like Wise. after the cutscene. Uh, Sword to the Wise? Uh, don't do that. Okay. Stabby, stabby. Okay. Oh, we have to talk to him again. Sort of the wise bad. Okay. Came from your dead father. Your just so okay. this one auto warp strikes for no mana. Close by. Whoa, really? Yeah, next. it's tied to your basic attack. <coughs> really? Yeah. Dang, that's awesome. Yep. So you basically just hold down the attack button and you just auto warp around? Yeah, if you're close enough to an enemy, you can auto warp strike with no mana taken up. Core joined my party. Wait, hold on real quick. Why is Core in our party? Because he said, what's up? What's up? We See? said, what's up? Auto warp strike. <laughs> Holy crap. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not using triangle there. <laughs> and plus it does a ton of damage. <laughs> Nice. So Kor's just in our party now? Yeah. Well, for the time being. He's a temporary party member. Okay. I'll say, whoa, 3,400. Jeez. He really is a bodyguard, isn't he? Yeah, he is a... He is, um, pretty strong. You can't change his equipment at all, because I would totally de-equip whatever's awesome on him and keep it for myself. Yeah. <laughs> he said you're only as good as your last battle. That's kind of dark. I mean, and deep. It's cool, but... Jeez. I guess if you're alive, you're pretty good. Did uh, Prompto oh. call Kor an immortal? That's his name. The immortal? Kor the immortal is what he's been known throughout as in the military. So I'm about to use a machine gun here. What? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Welcome to Final Fantasy, a game of swords, magic, and machine guns. <laughs> Join us as we go well, it's more like driving our convertible across the southern It's more states. like an anti-air turret that I am totally going to commandeer. <laughs> yeah. Nice. So I've got to do some quick feet. Sneaking, yep. Oh yeah, the spirit sword will block things for you too. No way, really? Yep. Like, it, uh, also I'm resistant to bullets because bulletproof vest. Yep. There it is. Hey buddy, I'll be taking this off your hands. <laughs> I'll take this, thank you. There we go. Get lost. Crit. <sighs> yeah, mow him down. Yeah. <laughs> this is how you cheese the game, by the yes. way. Yes. I, I wanted to let you know that, and it's free experience. You're getting items right now from killing those guys. Yep. Oh uh, yeah, I overheated it a little bit, but it'll be fine. It'll cool down in a second. <laughs> that is so crazy. Oh my gosh, freaking Sly Cooper all over again. Yeah, Is except it? now it's more fun. Yeah, except for instead of saving Murray's stupid tail, we get to freaking do this. I get to use a turret. <clears throat> I have fun in this play. I don't know freaking know what I'm saying. <laughs> whoa, whoa, okay. Yeah, More I guys. got bored of the turret. Plus, it overheated, so. <laughs> he got bored of the turret. All right, time to use my sword. Oh, I love this sword. This is um, one of my favorite weapons in the game. Yeah, I'm hungry. <laughs> Me too. Yeah. I've eaten like a granola bar for breakfast and that's it. Yeah. Down in Mississippi, it's hard to find breakfast. Yeah. I lied horribly. Well, that's, that's that's a terrible lie, but <laughs> But still. It's hard to find breakfast in our homes. <laughs> yeah. Anywhere else though. Freaking I could really go for Cracker Barrel right about now. You know Jim Sterling's from Mississippi. Ooh, do what now? 
I don't know if you know who that is. Jim Sterling's from Mississippi. Name sounds familiar. Who is that? He is a really angry British, um, like, critic. Oh, yeah. If he's British, how is he from Mississippi? Well, he's from Britain. Good question. <laughs> but he lives in Brandon, Mississippi. <coughs> right oh, now. really? Yeah. Cool. Somewhat dangerous. Marshall. Why does the name sound familiar? To take that down. Like, what did he do? <laughs> they are talking like guys. Uh-oh. <laughs> it sounds familiar because you think he's a... Jim Sterling! Oh, 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 it was, uh, oh, oh, uh, Scott Sterling. That's it. <laughs> That's Scott Sterling. I got a laser sensor. Ow! Scott yeah. Sterling! The man! The myth! The legend! <laughs> Uh-oh. Whoa. Oh. No, Gladios. Oh, crap. Where? Okay. <sighs> yeah, feather. <laughs> Why is Phoenix Down literally just a down feather from a phoenix and it brings you back to life? Uh, you may After the know. battle, he'll, he'll get back up. Oh, so... Will he get experience points? Will he be okay? He'll be fine. Okay. You can't even heal him right now? Well, not yet. So when he's down, he's down? Can these characters die forever? I, mean, I know okay. that you can Well, Phoenix down, there's no permadeath. But, like, what happens if he, if you don't revive him by the end of the battle? Does he not get experience points? Is that the I think only... you have to go rest. Oh, well <laughs> <laughs> uh, man, poor Gladius. <laughs> he's on your back. Gladius is just like, oh, man. I was sitting for like 30 minutes with 1 HP, but man, I feel great now. <laughs> oh, glad that's over. Oh, man. I'm glad the battle's over. Now I can re I can get all my health back automatically. Well, it's smarter to stay down if you're injured like that. Yeah, true. <clears throat> um, there we go. Got that Hylix I used back. I was, you know, I was thinking that we'd record one more episode after this if we had time, but for one, I probably won't have time, and for two, I'm hungry, so I might Here's stop for food. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But, I mean, we still have the rest of this episode. Gonna, I'm going to probably poach some eggs myself. So we're about to go into our first dungeon dungeon. Holy crap. So this is where the game gets a little linear. Yeah. It's dungeon exploration. It doesn't really reward you enough, and you get attacked by goblins. Ah. So freaking... But it's short. We just went through all of the military, like, COD member people, and now we're going to go into a cave with goblins? Huh? Look. Sounds right to me. I adore dwarves. Uh, <laughs> gonna hurt my feelings again. <laughs> no, this starts so much pun. Uh oh. What? Oh yeah, we get generators. A generator? A generator? Whoa! I've never seen one of these before, even though I knew the name for some reason. No, he's seen it before. man, I do love me some light. Shut up, Prompto. <laughs> oh man, light's the best. Thank you. <laughs> I mm. guess this is a pretty sweet cave. Oh, it's no longer a cave. Okay. Yeah, it is. Pretty sweet underground area. It doesn't even feel like a dungeon. Whoa. <laughs> but it is. It's just like a dungeon. Dungeon is like like a castle, basically. Oh, this is more like a cave. But in Zelda, they would call this a dungeon. Yeah, definitely. I mean, Final Fantasy, they call it a dungeon, too, technically, but, I mean... Oh, hey, I can upgrade my uh, engine blade now. So, there is a way to play this game with oh, Noctis having all swords. Did you see the oh, yeah? Like, not... Hello? Not like, uh... <coughs> you can equip Noctis with pretty much any weapon. He's like Bards from Final Fantasy V. And their tormented souls just maybe... Yeah. I don't know. It was a Gerberin. What the frick is that? That is a Blizzard tank. Ice energy. Inventory full. Oh, I love the mix of magic and technology. Oh, yeah. So let me show you real quick. This is how you make new spells. Okay. So we are going to be using this. And we'll be mixing um, lightning and blizzard. What? Can you do that? Yeah. So it's going to look like it's going to be blizzara, right? Yeah. Well, I'm going to add a uh, item to it. What? Yeah. Quadcast. Blizzara Thundra 4. Potency 122. Is that like a one-time use, or do you have it forever? I have it for four times. Holy crap. So. 
Holy Go down, crap. craft. Holy crap, so it, it's like Blizzara and Thundra? Yep, it does Blizzara first and then Thundra. <coughs> Holy crap. <laughs> oh yeah, no, Prompto's heck? freaking out because it's a locked door. <laughs> <laughs> it triggers other events. So, only reason I can move through this, this cave thing pretty quickly is because... You know this door on. was closed. I didn't go explore it the first time because I already knew that. Plus, I'm holding the run button a lot. And yeah, I mean, I, I know how. Yep. Whoa, rocks. easy there. Bucko. You can take damage from rocks, by the way. Buckle up, buckaroo. Buckle up, buckaroo. Buckaroo. <laughs> Freaking. Caitlyn Jenner. Caitlyn Jenner. Jesus. Uh, <laughs> South Park Caitlyn Jenner, by the way. <laughs> uh, I don't think. No. But still. <laughs> How many people uh, no has she hit by with a car in that show? Every time she parked the car or, or started the car, she was hitting someone. Uh, feels like it. That's for sure. <clears throat> Buckle up, buckaroo. Come uh, on. Come on. Pick, pick it up. There we go. I, I'm kind of... I'm waiting for goblins to happen. It will. I mean, I guess they're just kind of like putting you in a sense of... Um, Suspense. Suspense, I guess. But Suspense. Suspense. But it's not really the same in this game, because it's... It's, safe. it's like trying to give you a sense of suspense in... Um, suspense in do we like, want to do the Chocobo mission after this? Because it's shortly after. Uh, yeah. Freaking... Hey, oh. There's goblins. Uh, whoa! Straight up just goblins! <laughs> you fight them in the intro. <laughs> yeah, I mean... And they are super weak. But they're just... Just goblin... But goblins. I mean, they're just goblins. <laughs> I mean, straight yeah, up. Yeah, if you want to get finesse, you hats, have to do like all these stupid weapon switch. Oh yeah, I'm back to where I started. Well, what so, the frick? They wrapped, or, they wrapped you around? Yeah, you're supposed to go that way, and then you go um, back to the center, and then go down. So, okay. well, then. this is one of those really kind of confusing sequential type dungeons. Wasn't there yeah, like it you wasn't. have to do this, this, and this, and then you can do this. Oh yeah, if you pick up some, get off track and pick up some items, goblins will attack you. <laughs> ah, um, that's our choker! <laughs> I got that from Hot Topic! <laughs> <laughs> I paid 30 bucks for that! Hey, that was expensive! It goes with my cosplay outfit! <laughs> don't, don't be mean to cosplayers. <laughs> I'm not, I love cosplayers. Freaking, I want to be a cosplayer. I'm just making fun of people who buy There's a character in this game topic. that you can cosplay as, and it's become a meme already. Oh, freaking uh, Cindy? No, oh. there's a fat guy. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> no, he just looks like a, a nerd. <laughs> and he's not really even fat as much as he is, like, chubby. Oh, yeah? And realistic looking. He's not really fat, he's just big boned. He's not, not big boned, that's dinosaurs. He's not really big boned, he's fluffy. He's not fluffy. Those are marshmallows. <laughs> he he is on the heavier side for yeah. sure, but he's yeah. not like no, he's not. You know how someone could be like fat but not horribly ugly because they're fat. <laughs> so <laughs> not <laughs> obese. Everyone else is not fat. So no obese. Yeah, compared to everyone else. Oh in yeah, the entire yeah. World. Everyone else in this universe, he is huge. Everyone in this He's world huge. is like our models. <laughs> well, I mean, it gives you something to aspire to, I guess. Uh, yeah. <laughs> mm. Josh likes Cindy, I guess. Yeah. Um, I don't know why. She's an interesting character, right? I mean, she's got a lot of personality, but still, she has personality as far as the eye can see. I just walked into a bath. <coughs> oh yeah, and then tarantulas. Uh, what? Yep. What about tarantulas? They're gonna be here in a minute. No Ooh, way. This looks promising. Giant tarantulas? Because yep. that's the only way Final Fantasy does tarantulas. Auto crossbow. Auto crossbow? How does that work? Well, you give it to Prompto. Yeah, I figure Prompto would be the guy to hold that one. And then he gets a machine gun. Crossbow. That's, that's weird that you equip them with stuff, but you don't ever control them. I mean, I'm sure Final other Final Fantasies have done that. I'm... No, this is the first. Really? Cause, well, no, sorry. 13, you only had direct control of one character at a time, but you could switch freely between them. <clears throat> Interesting. The so problem this... with Final Fantasy 13 is you only ever had to hit circle. Oh, yeah, giant, spi giant spider lady. That is not a tarantula. <laughs> Freaking gynophobia all over again. <laughs> Holy crap. Uh, I, I heard that game was pretty... Mm. It was bad. It was a bad time. <laughs> oh, this one might be immune to thunder. Stop. <laughs> I, uh, freaking... 
So that's how you do magic? You freaking throw grenades of magic? Oh yeah, I accidentally hit um, Ignis, Prompto, <laughs> and Gladius with it. Wow. My B. <laughs> My bad, I accidentally shocked you to death. Oh wow, she's charred. <laughs> uh, okay, hold on, I gotta switch out to fire. Freaking Gynophobia, for the guys that don't know, is a C-list game. I mean, it's, it's terrible. It's, it, it's like a zombie shooter, but it's not because you're shooting undead girls and spiders. It's weird. Like, it's a game where this guy has a fear of women and a fear of spiders, because gynophobia means the fear of women. Not erect, not gynophobia and arachnophobia, but whatever. He apparently has both phobias, and you act, your mother is like a witch, and she, like, gets you stuck in your own mind, and you have to battle, like, a bunch of women and a bunch of spiders, and it's stupid crazy hard because the controls are terrible, and then finally you get to the end, and it's a giant spider woman, like this. Uh, spider lady, only spider lady. The one in the game was more woman than spider. This one's just disgusting. <laughs> Ow. <coughs> Ow. Uh, my throat. Oh, yeah, this battle's hard. Jeez. We'll, we'll let this episode be 30 minutes, and then I'll uh, head to work. Prompto. I'm trying oh, to pick no. up. No, he's, he's down. All oh, right, crap. so. Can you pink stand him? Yeah, I can. Um, Let me give him a... Uh, the Butters pat on the back for the Stick of Truth fans ah, out there. It's okay, buddy. I love Butters. <laughs> butters! Butters are crowded, Butters! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow, he got Stay right Stay down! Up. Wow, holy crap, full health? How yep. did that happen? Sometimes you get lucky, I guess. I guess. <laughs> I love Peppers. Oh, no, that just cured his par paralysis? Really? There's no room to swing a sword in here. Are you supposed to get it out of there? Not really. I don't know how. There's another... It, there's another marker. You can... I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I, mean, I guess you're supposed to just defeat her, huh? Yeah. Arachne. This is crazy, dude. It is. And everyone is the paralyzed, <laughs> so I can't give them the high elixirs. <laughs> Oh no, it doesn't heal perma lost health during battle. Oh uh, yeah. Prompto. Prompto. Prompto move. <laughs> Prompto. Prompto is in danger. Ow. Again. I I I can't. I don't stop. know. I don't know how. I don't know how to help you, dude. <laughs> you I, uh, just get your butt beat by a spider. That's humiliating. Oh crap. The boom, 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 baby, on board. Okay. Sorry. Prompto, <laughs> you've used both my Phoenix Downs. <laughs> Quit being selfish. Yeah, stop using all my Phoenix Downs, dang it. Phoenix, right? <laughs> Phoenix up. <laughs> Full circle. <laughs> all right, we got yeah. it. She's worth a lot of experience, Ooh, holy too. Holy crap. I'm starving to death. Yet we're all very much <laughs> and yet, oh, you, no, car. you're not. Ignis, shut up. <laughs> you were downed like twice. What a jerk. Oh, I'm dying of thirst, and I'm dying of starvation, and yet we're very much alive. <laughs> Thank you, Ignis. <laughs> Positive outlook. Yep. Ignis is also <clears throat> the pun master. I think we've already yeah, discussed, we have that. Already discussed everyone, that. Everyone, everyone else just kind of delivers puns. Everyone's kind of there in the pun world, and he he owns it. Whoa. Now. Yep. Here's a tomb. Is this tomb? Tomb of the Conqueror. Mm -hmm. This is very Legend of Zelda-esque. I mean, granted, it's also very Final Fantasy-esque, but still. <laughs> well, instead of collecting the four gems of the element, you're getting uh, weapons. Weapons of the Kings, which actually, honestly, uh, it's better than crossbows. the four elements. So this is the new weapon we're getting. <laughs> yeah, well, there's an auto crossbow in this game, too, so it does count. Because it was an auto crossbow in that game, too. <laughs> you had well, to do Link training had an auto crossbow. It. She had two of them. Yeah, freaking. Have you ever played the 3DS version of Hyrule Warriors, Josh? It doesn't count. It's amazing. It's a spinoff. Yeah, Link's well. Crossbow training. And so is Link's Crossbow training. There's rumors that Link will, might appear in the new Breath of the Wild game. So, mm -hmm. just It's literally just a gender-swapped uh, Link. I mean, so you can play as a woman. So not to borrow the old maybe. Powers. You might be able, to, you might be able to just straight up choose whether or not you want to play as Link or Linkle. That'd be kind of cool. I don't think so, but I mean, that'd, that'd be interesting. Definitely. Oh, best thing about this game. Once you're done with the dungeon, warp back to entrance. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> Make them do the walking. Uh, more like go straight to loading screen, but still. Yep. I mean, it works, you know. 
Was there a Chocobo mission? There's going to be one. Is it really 1217? Uh, yep. Yeah, you probably should get going here soon. Well, I'll give it six more minutes. Or okay. five more minutes. Well, we get a phone call. It's probably core. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Uh, I forgot. Oh, we got no. our process stuff too. <laughs> yeah. In back up. Yeah. Whatnot. So after this phone call, I say we're, we're yeah. Done. So the empire's begun construction of a new base along the road west to the sky. That's the demo you got to play if you got Type Zero, which is also another huge area of the game. Really? This game's way different than the demo, though. That's as far as I remember. Interesting. Because used to you scrolled through the weapons, I think. In this one, you just do a quick swap. He has a bad habit of just hanging up on people. It's kind of rude. Anyway. He was. He is the prince. True. <laughs> Next time on Robits. Next time. Uh, we'll do that thing. Robits.